Hello everyone, Aaron Bent, aka Magic Man Crypto here. After spending a couple hours with uh, PT Magic, I must say that I am, I've been basically impressed. So this is little I, th I believe it analyzes a little bit differently than PT feeder and I'm just gonna kind of start off with that but I did want to answer an immediate question that someone had and that I kind of stumbled upon um, in the issues on uh, PT magic's github so question is it a ripoff oh Someone was claiming that it's a ripoff of PT Tracker and PT Feeder that could steal your API keys and wipe your accounts. You've been warned. Uh, this was posted in a Discord channel. Can you clarify your position on this claim? Now the creator of uh, PT Magic is going to uh, answer here. Yes, I am happy to clarify. In theory, PT Magic has access to the same file settings and whatever else that P, uh, Profit Trailer, PT Tracker, PT Feeder, and every other software you install or simply run on your computer has. So being careful is, of course, advisable, no matter what software you are using. PT Magic was developed by myself and a working colleague of mine. Both being software developers with the simple intention to build more complete add-on to Profit Trailer than currently existing, and without the need to uh, the need for just us two to spend any additional money. Somewhere during the development, we decided not to just develop this add-on for us two only, but to make it available to the public for free. In fact, I even used my real name to register a domain for this project, etc. So why on earth should we do something so stupid to steal from others, making it possible to sue the crap out of us? So with that being said, he has a point, right? So I'm going to kind of skip the next one. And I'm going to read here. Having that said, I can assure everyone that PT Magic is not accessing any personal API key. In fact, it does not use any API key to build the data as it only uses the public APIs of Bitrix, Binance, etc. Which I can um, I can attest to that as well because it doesn't ask it doesn't ask you for any API keys to input into this application so hopefully that answers anybody's concern or questions and I also wanted to bring up another point um, about this, that topic as well about this uh, PT magic possibly being um, a ripoff or whatever many people are not gonna like me when I say this but if there are paid uh, products. So let's say Profit Trailer. Everyone most likely that's paying attention to this has Profit Trailers, interested in Profit Trailer, right? We all need it to run this bot, right? So we're going to buy that. Now, people are making PT Tracker, PT Feeder, right? They are <clears throat> making these products and they're paid products. PT Tracker is a paid product. PT Feeder, you'd have to buy as well. Now, people are not going to like free softwares that are going to compete with paid products. So therefore, you may hear people that most likely may have an affiliate link for PT, uh, for Profit Trailer, PT Tracker, or even PT Feeder that may discourage you away from this product. Now, I'm not telling you to trade uh, any of those softwares for PT Magic. I'm just expressing another side of a possibility that people will say certain things to scare you away from a product. It's the same thing with coins. People will talk about a coin to get you to buy it. And then as soon as you buy it, or as soon as the price spikes, they will sell on their side and not tell you. So 
And I'm not saying that I've seen this firsthand, but I'm sure it happens. So there's always going to be an ulterior, ulterior motive to, um, to sometimes uh, people's uh, statements. So I could tell you not to even check out PT Magic. I could say, hey, I'm not even going to do a video on this because I have a profit trailer affiliate account. But it doesn't, it's not going to affect that. I do have a PT Feeder affiliate account, and it will affect that. And I'm not really worried about that because this is all about making the most out of out of this crypto space. You know, if we're not going to sit here and try and help each other to try and make the most profits, yeah, we're all trying to eat. But, I mean, if you're starving and I'm eating good, you know what I mean? It doesn't make sense. So... I also am, am pretty close. I've been working with Methadome, the, the, the creator of PT Feeder, and I also, uh, he also understands that I, I am um, trying to be unbiased when I make these videos. I try to be as unbiased as I can, even though when he comes out, PT Feeder, the, the update comes out, which I'm pretty sure it's going to have a GUI. I am definitely going to be checking that out as well. And I'm most likely going to be using that because I'm more familiar with PT Feeder and because I paid for it. <laughs> now, with that being said, I'm going to continue on to the next thing. And I'm going to talk about uh, the, my, my next phase of, of PT Magic. I'm actually pretty impressed with this, with this software. Um, it works slightly different from, <coughs> excuse me, it works slightly different from PT Feeder. Uh, so, looking at these charts here, it looks like it works based off of um, three market conditions, or three, basically three, is it not market conditions, three... Basically, it works off of the one hour... 12 hour and 24 hour, like basically charting uh, averages. So this is different and it bases, it changes um, market conditions based on that. So I'm going to show you um, what I found out while I was taking the three hour break. Uh, let me get, okay, I got to log in again. So, I, I will add that this, this works really fast. It's checking every minute, and it works really fast. That is one thing that really um, surprised me. So, I also have questions. I put in a ticket for uh, this reason here. It's not here. I put in a question about this here. Um, cause I, I trade on, um, Ethereum, so I'm pretty sure they'll give me an answer once, uh, they see that. So, okay. See, see how many times it's, it's, um, it's, it's making changes. So, and I think it's set to one minute. So it makes changes every, every, every minute. Um, it is also checking, it can, it's also checking uh, trading view as well. So I'm going to go over just a little bit more in depth than my first video uh, or my live video earlier. So see interval minute, minutes one. Um, here is the 24 hour. Uh, it's going to check the, the top 50 coins. Uh, here we go. This is 24 hour. This is one hour, 12, as you can see, 24. And actually, I'm not sure what uh, this means. This must be something... Um, slightly different oh because of coin market cap you can change it to that for a 24 hour you can change this to a uh, coin market cap okay and then you can leave this as exchange okay I see it now now here's where the global settings this is basically uh, in PT feeder this is where your bear boring um, bull would go so end of world right so this is interesting with uh, PT Magic, it has end of world and it has an and 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 
and so these are all basically like working together um, where is it so it has an and or or is it here it has an and or or basically function where if I can find it I just clicked on that didn't I so if that use if it okay it's in here so if it's using this and or or function here so defines trigger uh, define if triggers will be connected by and or or so it, it seems like it, it can combine um, triggers or it could separate it so let me see if I can kind of explain that a little better so I'm going to show you an example so this one is a pump and dump protect protection and this one has so it's this one a pump and dump it says or here it's going to check uh, it's going to check this one which is exchange one hour or it's going to check this or it's going to check the 24 hour and then apply this if it's true or if it meets that if it meets either this this or this so if any of these change by 10 percent, i believe if it changes by 10 percent or more it's going to put that coin in sell only mode and change the and change the, the profit of it to negative 10 percent the trailing profit to negative 10 percent and the sell value of that coin by negative 30 percent i believe all right now going back up here this goes by and so it's going to go through and see if these requirements requirements are met if any of them are met it's going to put it in that category which i have stayed in i stayed in oh okay it changed it to default perfect okay so i stayed oh no hold on sorry guys wrong uh wrong browser oh no okay it's the same thing so most of the day I've been in Jeez. all right I've been in um, to the moon so I made a couple changes so that I'm not in, I'm not in that um, in that setting so if it goes to to the moon it's going to apply the, these values and I and I believe when it applies these values it's going to change all trailing by to 0.15 now this is not an offset so it's going to apply that value this all sell value it's going to apply that value dca property sell value it's going to apply that value it's not going to go by any percentage or anything like that this will go by a percentage i i, I change all these values i'm changing values slightly to see how it works and um it went to default which i believe is bare sided if i'm not mistaken um, but it, if it wasn't bare-sided, it would have said uh, bare-sided here in the browser. So to see it, to see it in default, um, I'm gonna have to work on that and figure that one out as well. So this is giving you just a little bit more of um, an exposure to this, and I kind of, I kind of didn't like how a lot of people were trying to call it a scam. Um, just because you know it's a free it's a free product and I believe that a lot of people will definitely call it a scam or um, they'll call it a, a ripoff how's it a ripoff you're not buying it <laughs> and if it's free then do your research it doesn't have anything to do if you look at the um, installation it doesn't have anything to do with uh, let me see if I can find installation it doesn't have anything to do with your API keys um, but yeah, I mean, everything has access to your AP, to API keys, like he said, and hence why um, there was someone in my Discord chat or channel that actually um, put in place a, a mobile app for Profit Trailer, unofficial. And that's why I made sure I said, hey, does this have access to your API keys? You know, I don't know what exactly that app is going to do. So these are the questions that 
I feel everyone should be worried about or ask. But then again, also do your research on the the product as well. So I have a, I'm playing around with like six hundred bucks. So if something happens and he does end up doing this, I mean, I'm on YouTube, so I pro I probably could just bash him and make his product uh, look really bad. But then again, it's a free product, so it wasn't really gonna hurt, you know. So I I don't know. I took a risk and checked it out just because I got a couple requests on it. And for me so far, I like the way I like his answer. So I'm not going to knock him. And I also, I also, I don't even know, like, I'll show you this once it like, I just got a sale while I was talking to you guys. So I don't even know. There was one here. It bought it at three Oh seven. And this was a negative. This was like a negative. When I got it, it went down to like negative one. I'm like, all right, whatever. And then seven minutes later, ended up in my sale log. And I'm like, what? Went up this much. So I don't know what, I don't know what is doing it. This, this was, this was terrible. This was at negative eight. And it went up to, and then I doubled, I don't know if I doubled down, but I, I had a low BB DCA strategy. And, um, and it brought it back up to like around four and a half, five, negative four and a half, negative five percent. And then, it disappeared in my sales log. So I'm not sure what it's doing, but I, I got a couple sales today. So I'm not going to, I'm not going to hate like, yeah, when I applied this, this is my fault down here, the stop loss. So I'm not even trying to count that, but these I'm definitely going to give credit to, um, to PT magic so far. So, and it's not looking, it's not looking too bad. Um, I mean, it's checking every minute. I'm going to be doing some tweaking. And I'm not going to shoot this down just yet. Um, I, ha I, I, I have a couple here that I'm working on. And hopefully the market swings back up. and makes PT Magic look even better. Um, but yeah, it's not too bad. I just want to find out what's going on here. And then here I have estimated gain. Uh, I don't know what's going on with that either. So I have a couple questions, a couple things to, to do some research on, but I figured I, I at least give you guys a little bit more of an update as to what's going on. And basically just to tell you that like, not everything that, that you hear is going to be, um, untrue, you know, so, or true, you never know. That's why you have to do your research. And, and that's why I try to, I try to push on the people do, do your research. If you're going to use my settings, please modify them because I have them very strict. And the reason why I have them very strict is if I have them super aggressive and then it buys 10 bags and you're holding on to bags for a week, guess who you're blaming? You're going to blame me. So that's why I have my settings very strict. Now I don't mind helping you with the adjustment, but, um, see, it just changed the, um, it just changed the, the global setting to set to the moon. So when it does that, it applies and I'll just show you briefly just because that did that in front of me. Sorry, I'm running this on another computer. Now, um, just quickly here while it changed it to the, to the moon. So it must have met these requirements and then it's going to apply these. So I'll sell value and hopefully this doesn't make me look dumb. Okay, so it's down here. Um, wait, no, that's not it. Hold on. That's not it. I'll sell, va I'll sell value. So as you can see, I'm still trying to figure this one out because I could tell in feeder how it worked. But this one here, I'm unsure. So, and this one works different, man. Like it has two different, there's pairs, there's a pairs DCA and indicators file in, um, PT magic. And then also the one that you're running. So when I'm making changes, I have to make changes to both just because I'm not really familiar with how this works yet. So I'm making changes to both. So when it goes to apply anything, it makes, the, uh, um, makes the application. Actually, it might be, it might apply it to these. So once again, like I, I got to go through this and, and figure more, more out. Um, I'm trying to, I'm trying to use this as, or I'm trying to use knowledge that I have from feeder and transition it over to, to PT magic. 
it's not gonna, it's not gonna work. It's obviously, it's obviously not gonna work. So, if you guys are going to use this, once again, use strict settings and then modify more aggressive. The only advice I have for you guys, if you have any questions, reach out to me, join my Discord. Um, the Discord name is the Magic Man Three. I hope you guys or everyone has a good day. Um, and hopefully I have a better report for you guys later, maybe even tomorrow. I may have more of like a compiled, um, um, more detailed and in-depth review of PT Magic once I figure more stuff out. Because, you know, reading the, the wiki, it's not uh, that f laid out. It's not that laid out like how Feeder is. So I'm trying to figure out stuff out by trial and error um which sometimes you know that error could land into this <laughs> all right everyone take care magic man crypto out